I'm David Morrison, Senior Blender for Appleton Estate, Jamaica Rum, and I'm pleased to welcome you to Appleton Estate's Cocktails and Cuisine. I'm on a mission to pair Jamaica's best premium aged rums with some of the most delicious dishes prepared by our very own talented chefs. So, from the cliffs of Negril to the depths of the cockpit country, from Kingston City to the sleepy beachside villages, follow me as we unearth the heart of Jamaica, one meal at a time. Welcome to Harmony Hall. This newly renovated Georgian style great house in the parish of St. Mary is bursting with new life, culture, and entertainment. On the main floor of this landmark, tucked away behind a uniquely designed bar, is the Summer House Restaurant. Operated by sisters, Suzanne and Michelle Rousseau, Summer House's elegant and inviting atmosphere breathes life into their tagline. Simple food, meant to be shared. All right, so let me just welcome everybody first to Appleton Estates Cocktail and Cuisine. Okay, here at the lovely Summer House restaurant, right? I am sure this is going to be an unforgettable experience, not just for me, but for everyone, all right? So today we're going to be having an amazing experience with some fantastic food and some fantastic drinks. And one of the things that you're going to realize once we go through the experience today is that when you're having a meal, think about what you're having. Because at the end of the day, it's not just about the food. It's a combination of the food, and the drink that you have with the food that really gives you that incredible meal dining experience. While everybody enjoys, we're going to talk a little bit about what you have in front of you, right? So remember, I did tell you you're in for a fantastic experience. So you realize the food looks absolutely delicious, smells amazing. You can smell those wonderful aromas from the meal. So you're talking about both, if you put the glass to your nose, the aromas coming from the cocktail, as well as the aroma that you don't even have to try to get from the food. I mean, it's just filling up the place. Even though we're outdoors, it's amazing what the place smells like. So Michelle, I'll turn over to you so you can tell everybody what do we have here on the plate in front of us? Okay, um, so lamb actually pairs really well with certain kinds of rum drinks because you tend to use uh, um, notes of like citrus and you can have aromatics like mint and, and that type of stuff, sage in there, as well as a little bit of um, you know honey. So what we've created here today is actually a marmalade glazed rack of lamb. Um, it has, um, so the marmalade glaze is citrus with marmalade, a little bit of rum, and a little bit of honey in it that's reduced. Um, we've grilled the lamb, um, also marinated a little bit with rum as well, and some sage and thyme and oregano oh, nice. and all of that. And instead of serving it, you know, lamb and roast potatoes, it's kind of like, there's a play on that, it's a bit more Mediterranean. So we've smashed some butter beans, so the beans that you would get in oxtail. Mm -hmm. So we sauteed that up, we smashed it out, not pureed it, smashed it so you get a little texture with a little bit of mint and, and stuff like that. And then we're serving on the side a um, Parmesan risotto that has some rum flambéed mushrooms and grilled vegetables. So the whole play is a little bit Mediterranean. There are notes of citrus, there's notes of mint, and all of that works really well with like a really refreshing, clean rum drink. So, all works. right, well, it's, 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 it's funny you said that because a lot of the components that you just mentioned in the food are actually also present here in this cocktail. So this is what we call a honey scooter, and it's made with the Appleton Estate 12-year-old rare casks. And it's actually a bit of a play on a gimlet. So a gimlet is an old drink. It's made of gin, um, lime juice, simple syrup. And in this case, the sugar that we're using is actually honey. You know, nice and Jamaican, mm -hmm. right? Real Jamaican when you talk about honey. Good old Appleton Estate, 12 year old rare casks and some lime juice. Really simple, but really complex because what you find is that the rum itself has beautiful toasted oak notes. You get nice coffee, you get rich orange peel coming through. You get that beautiful vanilla that comes through as well. And when you look at the way the drink is built up, I mean, it really complements the lamb. So you get that nice bright citrus coming through. You get that nice sweetness, which works really well with this marmalade as well. And you get that nice mint that comes through as well, which also goes really well with lamb. Mm -hmm. So everybody enjoy. I want to see everybody going through, having the meal, you know, eating the food, 
having a drink and looking at how the two things pair up. And then when we move to dessert, because I know we're getting taken up a notch. Because <laughs> hey, who doesn't love the dessert? And we know the chocolate goes really well with rum. So go. we have actually what a mousse au chocolat with a sablé crust. So the sablé is a sort of a chocolate crust with a little bit of almond flour. So we have a chocolate sablé crust. We have a little bit of salted caramel, some toasted almonds, and we put a classic French mousse. There's no gelatin. It's just classic French home style mousse technique with butter and heavy cream and eggs and then we put a rum chantilly on top of that and a little bit of caramel sauce and he can tell you what we're going to drink with that take a bite then we're well thirsty <laughs> all right everybody remember i did promise you a fantastic day and i think it's it's it hasn't disappointed us right and this is the perfect way to end a fantastic day because we have a decadent dessert being served with a luxurious rum, all right? So everybody has before them a glass of the Appleton Estate 21-year-old Nassau Casks. Beautiful rum. And this is a rum that really ought to be savored and enjoyed. When you compare the chocolate in your dessert with the nuances in your Appleton Estate 21-year-old Nassau casks. You're going to recognize that there are unparalleled elements that you can compare. Your 21 year old will have beautiful toasted almond notes, coffee, cocoa notes, vanilla notes, rich orange peel, rich vanilla notes coming through as well. And it is going to be a divine pairing with your dessert. Cheers to a lovely meal. Cheers to a fantastic rum.